Today I'm going to do a video on uh, using stainless steel pans to uh, cook food. I've had a number of questions from friends and family members um, about using nonstick. You know, there's some new ceramic nonstick um, products on the market, but um, there's some question as to you know whether those uh, some of them contain Teflon. Some of them are marketed as green. Um, we were looking the other day actually uh, do contain Teflon. Um, and then the ones that are just straight ceramic, a lot of the complaints um, from the reviews I've seen is that that ceramic uh, coating eventually comes off, and I've experienced that myself. So I use stainless for a lot of my cooking. Um, the big complaint that I've heard from uh, from friends and family is that uh, when I go to tr you know try to cook an egg, that the egg will stick, and there's no way to you know to cook an egg uh, in a stainless pan. If you don't do it right, you certainly can have quite a mess on your hands. It's um, Pretty difficult to get egg off of uh, you know anything once the the proteins kind of bond to the metal but um, I have a technique that I use that works pretty well and that's what I wanted to show here today um, first thing I do is I, I get the stainless pan hot then I add a little oil I like um, just using a little bit of extra virgin olive oil um, let it just coat the pan you definitely want a little bit of oil down you don't need a ton uh, but if you cook if you cook on uh, completely dry stainless steel, it is a little bit trickier. I've got a couple of utensils that I use. Um, one, I like just a steel spatula. Um, this Forstner one is, is pretty nice. I like the wood handle because you can um, grip it, it doesn't get slippery. Um, and then you can also just use a spatula. This is the Rubbermaid um, spatula. America's Test Kitchen reviewed this. Uh, this is one of the ones that they like a lot. Of, I like it as well. So I'm gonna cook up a couple of eggs. Um, so then I'm just going to do uh, scrambled. You can do a fried egg this way. Um, I usually use the, the steel turner if I'm going to try doing a, um, doing a fried egg uh, just because it's a little bit easier to, to keep it moving. So I'm just crack them on in. You can see um, the pan's pretty hot so I'm going to get this moving right away. I really don't want those proteins to, to stick because once they start to stick, um, that's when you get a mess on your hands. So you can see, yeah, you know, I did get a little bit of sticking there, but I, I, I worked this steel edge um, into it and I don't let that build up. I'm gonna add a little bit more oil. Just keep that moving. If I was gonna use a, um, a silicone spatula, I would have, uh, at this point, I would have been kind of stuck. So if you're going to use a silicone spatula, um, you know, don't use as much heat. I'm just going to kill my heat. That's all I needed. You can see just, uh, just a uh, few seconds here, and I got, I got my cooked egg. I'm just going to flip that up. I like my eggs. I'm not completely cooked. Scrape that off. Use the pan. And you can see when I get that into the sink, I've got a little bit of a towel here. I'll, I'll wipe it, um, wipe it down a little bit. But you can see once I get that into the sink, I really, I don't have much work to do at all to get that clean. 